Starting this game off at 32%. Let's see if we can hit 33%. Hello, my fellow gamers. Welcome, welcome back to the game here. Welcome back to Red Dead Redemption 2. With the option for three missions. Thing. Let's see what that says. Morfinian? Uh, don't care. Not my problem. Good evening. Let's go see what Dutch wants. I feel like Dutch is like go to. What now? You sweating yet, Dutch? Of course I'm sweating. We're in some disease-ridden, swampy, Dixie whistling shithole. <laughs> uh, I meant about what Trelawney said about these bounty hunters. Well, not sweating as such, but maybe a little gentle perspiration. <laughs> Until we know more, ain't too much harm in wasting good liquor on sweating. So? So, I think you should pay Mr. Trelawney a visit and find out exactly what he knows and who he spoke to. Take Charles with hey, you. Charles, okay. Oh, the sight of the pair of you would make a statue sing out its secrets. Okay. Go to Charles. I like Charles. I mean, I'll leave the one I don't like. Maybe Bill, just because of Red Dead 1. Charles, I need you for some business in town. Come on. Okay. Oh, this is the Native American guy, isn't it? If I remember right. Okay, boy. Bonnie's location, okay. Shouldn't be too bad. So, where are we going? Dutch wants us to have a talk with Trelawney. About these bounty hunters who are coming for us. Hoping he can tell us who they are or where they're coming from. Just to be safe, I want the tomahawk out. Okay. And your deputies now. <laughs> Something like that. As soon as we laid eyes on that fool of a sheriff who runs that town, I knew Dutch was gonna play him like a fiddle. <laughs> on the run from one bunch of lawmen, working for another. Interesting. How in that plain one. sight, Dutch calls it. <laughs> hmm. So, spirits seem good. In Doing the new camp, again. I mean. We got some space between us and that mess now. I ain't seen no more Pinkertons for a while. There's these bounty hunters, of course, but Dutch don't seem too worried about it. Can't believe they're still coming after us. We didn't even get away with the money. Yeah, but they don't know that. Of course. Trelawney. I've only met him a couple times, but he's... he's a strange one. Oh! This Trelawney. Okay, I remember this guy. In the gypsy camp. Oh... Reckon it's that one with the fire outside. Let's take a look. Someone got here first. So it's Oh you. no. By the looks of one of these, isn't it? Call. Check the house. What do you think? Bed's not made, so he must have been here recently. Here, man, okay. There's some blood here. That ain't good. I'm now stuck. Thanks, Charles. Yeah, 12 hours Look. ago? Tracks. No body? Come on, Not yet. This food's barely touched. Looks like he left in a hurry. There's the bag. We should get going. Get going? Hmm. 
They went down the path here. How's your tracking these days? All right, I guess. <laughs> well, lead the way then. Not the kind of place I'd expect to see Trelawney staying in. No? Normally scams himself into the best hotel in town. You know, when me and Javier went down with Trelawney to get Sean after the bar fight, I swear, he talked the whole way and never actually said a damn thing. I thought you knew. That's his special talent. They could be 20 miles away by now. We can track them that far if we need to. Depends on how much you want to find them. Yeah. I still ain't sure about that. See? They must have crossed over the tracks. Hey, look. Let's go see what those fellas have to say. Oh man, we're gonna fight. Excuse me. Yeah. Uh, have you seen him? <clears throat> we're uh, we're looking for our friend. I don't think he's here. Ah, <laughs> uh, you seen a strange sort of fella, sort of formal. Strange, sure. Formal, nah. He uses a cane. Looks a lot like this one. Yeah. All right, you two. Where the hell is he? We both better get out of here. Come in. <laughs> 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 Son of a bitch! Okay! Okay, for Christ's sake! They took him to a cabin. Over by the cornfields. Which cornfields? Left! Down the path there by Braithwaite Man. Wait, what? I don't like it. Alright. That should do it. Twenty more dollars on you? Yeah! Money. Enter it. Come on, let's go. Follow me. I think there's a way around so we don't have to go through the Braithwaite's place. Yes. I've spent enough time there. After you, then. Ha! I will you gladly okay? let him do it. I'm good. What do you think they want with Trelawney? Could be any one of a hundred things. It just depends if any of them involve us. You think he'll talk? Of course he'll talk. He'd sell his own sister to save a train fare. He don't know how not to talk. He don't know where we're holed up, though. At least I don't think he does. I don't know why Dutch still deals with him. Always disappearing for weeks on end. He's got his uses, and, well, loyalty matters to Dutch. Of course. But is Trelawney loyal? Yeah, kind of. I guess Trelawney ain't exactly disloyal. Just got a big mouth. Don't worry. If he talked, I'll goddamn find out what he said. Well, all he knows is we're in the area. It doesn't mean he knows. Nothing's ever straightforward where Trelawney's involved. I learned that much. Oh, no. I mean, oh, how much again. time have we wasted getting this fool out of trouble? He somehow manages to be both lucky and unlucky at the same time. <laughs> That's one way of looking at it. But he always finds some way to pay us back. Just when we think about cutting him loose, he brings us something big. I guess that's his special talent, keeping fish on the line. All right, come on. That's a big cornfield.
must be it. Oh boy. The thing is, after that sack, this will be remembered like a good time. Put the man down, gentlemen. Is that the lot of them? I, I think so. So uh, you're alive. Allegedly. Well, don't worry, they won't be for much longer. Okay, go get them, Arthur. I can handle this. What am I doing here? Who knows what he told them? Let's get after those sons of bitches. Quick, find them. They're trying to hide in the fields. Look at the birds. Go that way. Oh, God, what? Why am I using tomahawk, you ask? I will find you, bastards! He did. Dang, tomahawks are brutal. The hell are they? More money? What the heck? You can barely throw like 15. You made a big mistake messing with us. You wait till I find you. I'll make sure he's dead. We got one more, Charles. You can throw 20 bucks, because why not? I like money mad at this point. Over there, where the birds are. Birds. I didn't see the birds. I was looking at money. Can't have gone far. You see anything? <laughs> He's mine. Let me take him. Get out of here. You have my friend. He's not your friend. I'll give you money. That throwing knife, though. Come on. He, he should have taken the money. I know. I'm a fool. Oh, shit. Thank you. 
Oh, that they can see me, but I can't even see that because of the corn. God damn you! Dang it! He's backing off inside. Get after him! How are you supposed to do that? Like. Rolling block, Alright. Rare rolling block. I'm, I'm taking that. You alright? As yeah. my microphone falls over it never again. Never goes easy, does it? Sure don't. Come on. Let's go see how badly they beat up the slippery fell. I wonder how much trouble he's brought with him. Uh, <laughs> guess we'll soon find out. This is new. I don't think I've seen this. Yeah, I you can't catch a break now, Arthur. Our luck's held this long. We got out of worse scrapes than this one. Mm, so I heard. <laughs> sure. There's three different kinds Plus of government the, agents. Tomahawk, so I may go at weapons and see what I can do. Anyway. Uh, I hope you're right. Hopefully, Trelawney here is okay. Mr. Trelawney, where are you? Boy. Well, he's still here at least. Put your feet up, why don't you? You okay? Never finer. Oh. So, who was they? Uh, they were bounty hunter. Uh, attached to Cole Stoudemire. Okay. They weren't looking for me, per no. se. What you tell them? Not much. I told them I was... An intellectual. Come down here from Oregon. Looking for a job at the university. Of course, they didn't believe me. Seems you stirred up quite a hornet's nest in Blackwater. So I keep hearing. It might be best if I stay with you gentlemen for a while. Can't go back to that caravan now. All right, Charles. You take Trelawney back to camp. I'll catch up with you. Okay. Huh. Okay. Bounty hunters, Pinkertons, lawmen. Everywhere we go, more and more civilization. Perhaps this is it from now on. We shall see, I guess. Usually a chapter ending thing. It seems like that. Trelawney has a mission for me. Let's go see the stranger. And then, horse for dinner? That sounds disgusting. You know the gunsmith's over here. I know he probably hates me still, but. Uh, I don't want to go anywhere. Pay with my body and my mind. Yeah, what, what, what you all pay? He's seen things, guys. He's seen things. Hope you brought money this time. Ain't gonna get away with swiping in here anymore. What can I do for you, huh? Oh, he doesn't have stuff for the uh, tomahawk. So, the trapper, maybe? Have we seen a trapper? Oh, hell. Sorry, Hello, I didn't mean to sir. wake you up. New in town? 
<sighs> Candy's in the middle there. See what he has. Hopefully he has Tomahawks. Must left in my self-respect. I have a catalog too, up here. Ah, let me see. He has the stuff I don't want. We was all about hospitality in the South. Seems to me ever since them graves turned up. Live cricket sold out, that kinda sucks. Like little live worms. I'll take some of that. You know, I definitely want the poor survivor. I like it. Something different for once. Good be the Earl. Hey, where's your pride, you fool? Um. There's more food stuff, so. The only way I can think of is a trapper. I have no idea what the trapper even is. Anything else? Well, I ain't afraid of you, old Mr. Gray. You Oh, it's a wardrobe. Oops. Can you? Thanks. Is there a trapper in this area? Fence, butcher, stagecoach, Arthur's house, post office, moon. Let's go see the stranger and caught it in an episode. Where was he? Well, give him fella something to eat. Yeah. Let's see what this guy wants. Strange, what's okay up, man? There, mister? If you need me to move. Move? I am. I sitting in the wrong place. Excuse me? No, I didn't mean any offense, sir. Please. I don't get your meaning. I'm very sorry, sir. You have yourself a fine day, and I apologize for any offense I may have inadvertently caused. What are you drinking, mister? Nothing, sir. Nothing at all. Why are you acting so strange? I don't mean to. I'm sorry for any offense. How could you have offended me? I have no idea. But I had no idea how I offended the last fellas. And they stole my wagon on account of my impudence. Stole your wagon for back check? Mm, they didn't like my medical practice, I suppose. I was helping folk. And that wasn't popular? I was undercutting the competition. Or I was too colored. Or I was irritating in nature. Or I was some know-it-all big city slicker here to demean some good old boys of my fine words. The exact variety of my sins was the source of some conjecture, so they undercut me. That ain't very nice. That was my impression. Still, compared to the gutting, castration, defenestration, and crucifixion they offered me, I felt I got off lightly. Imaginative bunch. Yes. But... No great love of my medical practice. Too free with my wisdom and services. Which way they go? Down the road, that away. Stay here. I'm sort of forced to. Uh. Please don't go to any trouble on my account. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. Next time on Red Dead Redemption 2.